Hey guys, it's Thomas here. Hope you're having a great day today. And this is a quick overview and walkthrough of RunMate, which is my Notion template for run planning and tracking. Okay, so let's, uh, let me give you, first of all, like a quick uh, rundown of the template. It's pretty simple, one page template, but I think it's pretty effective actually. And it has three main sections. So first one is you can quickly add your sessions and your runs. The second is the session calendar, which is kind of like the main visual visual um, part of the of the template. This is how it looks like uh, when you plan your sessions in a given month. You can also view your planned uh, planned runs in a table table view. But I really like this uh, visual calendar uh, point of view on 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 the sessions. And the third section is. A simple analytics dashboard, which uh, shows your plan at a glance and completed sessions, but I will get back to that a little bit uh, later. Okay, so let me show you how the template actually works. So, of course, let's start with adding a session first. So, let's say I want to plan uh, a long run. This is um, how the page uh, for each session looks looks like, right? So, you can plan your, let's say it's a long run, as I said. You can add your road type. So let's say this would be uh, this is going to be a trail uh, run with a planned distance. You can either use kilometers of or miles. So let's say it's 10, uh, 10 kilometer uh, run, and uh, I would also add it to the analysis under long runs so that it so that it shows up in the analysis sections section. So this is uh, this is the data that I would input for for uh, for my plan. Uh, plan session, and of course, this pops up uh, in 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 the calendar view. So let's say I finished uh, this uh, this uh, this run. So what I can uh, put here is the time load, which is essentially the the number of minutes this run took. So let's say this, this would be fifty five, for example. So this uh, gives you an automated calculation of the of the tempo or the implied tempo. And uh, you can also add some subjective data for the run. So how did it feel? One to five stars. So let's say this was a four star run for me. So pretty good. And perceived effort, one to 10. One, super easy. 10, super hard. Let's say this was a five for me. So somewhere in the middle. And of course, I mark it as uh, as a done run. And you can use this uh, uh, this space here to add any further notes for your run or, or screenshots from your Strava app, for example, or anything that you might uh, you might be using. But this is the kind of structured data that you can input in the template. Um, so that's, uh, that's, uh, that, that shows up uh, here uh, like this. And just to give you a quick overview of the analysis section, so what this gives you is, is an overview or breakdown by the run run type. It shows you the progress of sessions, so number of sessions planned, number of sessions that uh, have been done, and your aggregate data around the distances, uh, the times, and also your like average aggregate uh, tempos achieved for each run type. And here in the sessions completed, this is a pretty simple point of view on on sessions done, so number of sessions done for each uh, each run, and percentage of sessions done versus all sessions uh, planned. So it shows you basically your progress in your plan, and that is pretty much pretty much it. Um, I think just to finish up, like I think Runmate is a great tool for planning any type of run. So if you're planning to achieve, I don't know, let's say like a 5K or you're planning for your half marathon, marathon over over four, four, eight, 16 weeks, whatever the time frame might be, I think there's a great way to, you know, find uh, any any plan that uh, that you feel comfortable with and use this as kind of like an interactive tool where you can input the plan and, 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 and track it. So I use uh, this template myself. That's why I created it in the first place, and it's been working uh, working out pretty uh, pretty well for me. So I do hope you find it uh, find it useful, and don't hesitate hesitate to reach out anytime to me if you have any questions or suggestions of how to improve that. That would be super appreciated. So thank you very much. Have a great day and uh, keep running. Take care.